Hello, mate. Before you start, yeah. I'm promoting artists on my podcast. All right. Would you mind if I just share what you're doing? Yeah. I'll ask you a quick question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, we're here at the Edinburgh Fringe. Oh, sorry, I found I'm you. <laughs> just a spot on. I, I found you here on the floor on the on the on the on the cobblestone pebbles of the mall. Yeah. Um, what, what are you doing? Uh, painting, spray painting. So, okay. Yeah, I'm not ready yet, but uh, yeah, it's full of sprays. You, you're just about to set up, so you'll do a spray painting out here in public. That's right, yeah. Um, why would you share your art in this way? Why? Hmm. I never thought why. I just do this, that's what I do, so yeah. I, I, is there something that feels natural for you to do it in this way? Because, you know, I, I consider an artist, I would, I think normally they may, they may be at home in their shed or their garage doing something like this. But you're here, out here doing it in public. Well, artist is a very loose word, so it can mean many things for different people, but definitely, I mean, I'm painting, so I suppose that's a, it's public, a public painting, so it's a show. I put music on, I usually get a crowd, I try to do it as fast as possible, so it's more an experience than not the final result. But the final result is, has to be good too, but the experience itself of the... Uh, so it's a performance. Tell me a little bit about that experience for you doing this in front of people. How does that feel? Uh, it feels natural because I've been doing it for uh, 16, 17 years, so it, it wasn't natural back then. So it, uh, yeah, yeah, I became used to over time. But uh, yeah, I like it. I think uh, when you do something and you see how people is engaged and how they react, that it gives you energy, so you do it even better, even faster, you focus even more. So yeah, there is a, a play of energy between the audience and, and yourself. And the opposite is true, if you, if you are not feeling it, then people can feel it, then they walk away, therefore you feel it less and less. So yeah, it's a, yeah, that thing. There's a give and take with energy with audience, isn't there? Um, and, it, and it resonates, doesn't it, throughout the throughout the art. I've noticed that within within theatre, and it's interesting that you've brought that uh, art in in painting. It's almost the same. Mm. Yeah, the same goes for any kind of audience. I mean, uh, yeah, you you react to how they react, and, and it goes on. Yeah. So yeah, I never really thought of uh, theatre, for example. But yeah, it's the same thing. And then I guess that something is created within the artwork that's in front of you. Yeah. From that energy. Yeah. So, yeah, I don't know what to answer to that question. I guess, I guess there's not always an answer. I guess we're kind of, we're looking, we're looking for something different, aren't we? We're uh, exploring as we go through with our craft. Yeah. So where do we find out a bit more about you then? If someone, are you always, do we always find you here? Or can we find you online well, anywhere? No, usually just down there. I'm, I'm here all year round. So I'm here in Edinburgh every Saturday down there. Wonderful. Sorry, what's your name? Again? David. David, nice to meet you, David. Nice to meet you. Um, thank you very much for answering a few yep. of those little tough questions there. No, no, um, if good, you'd yeah. like to, I'll give you my details. Yeah, 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 if like you'd to like to that, catch yeah, up course. outside of the fringe, um, maybe we can explore a bit more about your journey and the artwork that you oh, do. Oh, it's a podcast. Yes, oh, yeah. That's Scan the QR code on the back. I'll, I'll definitely. Wonderful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice to meet you, David. Good luck.